Boris Johnson has been warned he will not survive the long term as aides eye up the next conservative leader, a commentator has claimed. Boris Johnson grew increasingly isolated as he battles to cling on to power over party allegations when five aides resigned from No. 10 in less than 24 hours. The Prime Minister has now been warned by journalist Trevor Kavanagh that he will not survive the long term. Downing Street said Mr. Johnson acknowledges the challenging situation after the resignation of one of his longest-serving advisers, Manira Mirza. Speaking to Talcradio, Mr. Kavanagh said, This is the beginning of the end, I don't think there's any question of his surviving in the long term. I don't even see him surviving in the short term. When Manira Mirza decided to quit, this is the severing of 14 years of very, very close cooperation and friendship. There are people who are pointing to the fact that she is quite close to Rishi Sunak and her husband, in particular, is a close friend of Rishi Sunak. The writing seems to be on the wall as far as Boris is concerned and in reverse as far as Rishi is concerned. He is now emerging with a campaign that's already up and running effectively as the frontrunner for the succession and I think he will be very hard to stop now. People are beginning to decide where their futures lie. If they aren't with Boris, if they aren't in Downing Street, are they going to be part of the new regime? It comes as Johnson quoted from The Lion King, insisting change is good, as he sought to keep staff on side after No. 10 was rocked by five resignations. The Prime Minister channeled the philosopher monkey Rafiki in the Disney film as he tried to boost morale in a speech to aides on Friday morning. Ms. Mirza quit in anger over his use of a false Jimmy Savile smear against Labour leader Sir Keir Starmer, while under pressure over allegations of lockdown breaches in No. 10. Chief of Staff Dan Rosenfield followed, as did Principal Private Secretary Martin Reynolds and Communications Director Jack Doyle, who were all implicated in the Partygate scandal. The exodus continued on Friday when policy adviser Elena Narozanski quit, further adding to the turmoil as Mr. Johnson clings onto power. Speaking to staff in the cabinet room as others tuned in on Zoom, the Prime Minister said, as Rafiki in The Lion King says, change is good, and change is necessary even though it's tough. 